to Gab and Jam, episode 267. And what are we talking about? All right, so we're in Podmas 2022. Our huge big topic is principles of minimalism and the DIY rock star. But today, we wanted to talk about the detox your inbox or digital declutter. Yes, 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 yes. So I, what I try to do is I try to, you know, I try to check my email, you know, five or six times a day. Ooh. And I always just delete stuff that right. I don't need. Good. So, so that's I, I one of the principles that. is Honestly. touch it once, do something with it. Like, yeah. don't go back, don't keep nope. it. Because then that way, when you actually see it, assign where it's supposed to go. Yeah. If it's trash, if it's supposed to be in a folder. I yeah. love it. And, and 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 what you could do is even unsubscribe with some yeah, of that stuff. Good, that, yes. that might make it a lot quicker. But a lot for me, I, I probably could unsubscribe more, but I just delete them anyway. Okay. It's like I, I see something as like, okay, delete, 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 delete. And then, you know, I get to what I need. So when I say that I check my emails about five, six times a day, it's not like, oh, I'm spending hours doing it. Right. No, I, it might take me five minutes. Yeah. You know, because I'm kind of going through, going through, going through, going through, you know, because even places that I normally, you know, shop, you know, like, yeah. like, like Sweetwater, you know, yeah. Sweetwater is always sending me something mm-hmm. every day. So I don't necessarily want to unsubscribe, but I'm not interested in buying anything right now. Okay. So I just, I just delete it, okay. you know? So, I, like I mean, that. that's the same thing, you know, and you, we shop with Amazon or places that you normally shop yeah. will send you stuff. Yeah. And I don't look at it. If, if I'm not in, if I'm not looking yeah, for so something, well. yeah. I don't look at it. I don't care if they tell me it's a sale. I don't look at it. I, I, I just get rid yeah, of it. Yeah, very disciplined. Yeah, I get rid of it. So. Okay, I like that method. I'm, that's goals for me. Yeah. Uh, I'm the person that says unsubscribe. So if I see, you know, sometimes I'll, I'll go down that rabbit hole where I will search for a particular brand. Like, I love Uncommon Goods. Mm-hmm. But if I see that there are like 15 unopened emails, you know, I delete those. And then sometimes, not for Uncommon Goods, but for some other places, I'm like, okay, you know what? You haven't bought anything from them in three years. Yeah. So I go through and I actually unsubscribe. So that is yeah. just one way. Um, the other thing is to put spam in the proper folders every time you see it. There are some emails that seem like they still keep coming, even though I put them in spam. Yeah. But I know for Xfinity, if you do it enough, eventually, whatever that particular email address is. Yeah, so I'm, see, and, and again, I probably could do that more. I just delete it. You know okay. what I mean? Again, it, it takes me two seconds. It's like, it, it'll probably take me longer to find my spam uh, folder than to just delete it. Because again, I look at it and it's like, I don't know you. You know what I mean? It's cool. <laughs> you know what I mean? That's just, just the way it, it normally goes for me. Now, a thing that I used to do that I don't do as much anymore is that for things that I want to keep, mm-hmm. um, I used to would take the time to put it in a folder. Oh, so, yeah. so I would create a folder that, yeah. that you know, whereas now it's sort of like, if I've run across it a couple of times and I never did read it, I just say, I'm never going to read this. Ooh. I delete it. All right. So, that's, I mean, that's, that's, that's kind of what I'll do. With those. There. So, right. It's right. like, I'll, I'll just, because I, I get tired of seeing it. Yeah. You know, and it's like, okay. It's clutter. Uh, I'm sick of seeing it. So I, <laughs> You're talking about digital clutter. Get right. rid of the clutter. Yeah. All right. Uh, another tip is to be thoughtful enough on the front end to put downloaded files and screenshots, and this is probably me talking to me, yeah. into the proper folder. So a lot of times I'll take screenshots yeah. and need to rename them and don't, or need to put them where they're supposed to be, whatever it is, the reason why I took the screenshot, and sometimes I don't. And then that ends up being uh, file clutter, but, but eventually I get upset, just like I do with the office and everything else. And end up deleting just everything in the downloaded folder, which is not good. Yeah. Because there might be some things I need, and then I have to go find it again, which is a waste of time. So, again, I'm trying to find ways to not waste that time. Yeah. To make it, once you do it, you spent the time to do it, so now just spend a little extra time to just go ahead and rename it and put it into the yeah, folder. Yeah, put it in a proper folder. Yeah. yeah. And then, finally, we keep talking about it, but we can't stress it enough, cancel unwanted subscriptions. Yeah. Or, even for me... um. We just did the thing with SoundCloud where we had uh, come off the premium, mm-hmm. um, but then we decided we needed it. The good part about coming off and then going back on is that they had a Black Friday sale. Right, yeah. So we were able to get the same subscription, yeah. but for a third off. Right, yeah. So, you know, even if it's something like that, I'm not intentional about that. I know some people really plan that stuff out. Mm-hmm. It just happened that way, but that was like a win-win. Yeah, like, it really was, yeah. You know, like, geez, you save money, and then, you know, for a minute, you actually cleaned out some of the files because right. you needed to. Yeah. And so now it's fresh, clean page, and yeah. 
So yeah. So detox the inbox. That is our our goal and hopefully our our uh, want for you as well. If you're enjoying this uh, DIY Rockstar Minimalist Principles journey, make sure you subscribe. We'll be back tomorrow talking about things that you can do for your home life or more intentional. Okay. All right. If you dig the vibe and you want to be a part of the tribe, be sure to subscribe. Wishing you love, peace, and peace.